Rituximab, which is an anti-CD20 monoclonal antibody, has been one of the most significant advances that we've had in the last decade in the management of non-Hodgkin lymphoma, leading to significantly improved outcomes in a variety of B-cell lymphomas. So uh, certainly the goal would be to see whether or not a better anti-CD20 monoclonal antibody could be developed uh, that would add to efficacy or as well a different anti-CD20 that might continue to work when rituximab is no longer working. So GA101, which is the anti-CD20 monoclonal antibody, which is the focus of this trial, is a novel drug. It is considered to be a type 2 monoclonal antibody, so it is different from rituximab in a number of ways. It's been bioengineered to have higher efficacy at a number of levels. So in preclinical testing, so prior to patient testing, it has been shown to have a higher activity in terms of inducing tumor cell death, and as well a higher activity of harnessing the immune system or the cellular response of the immune system against the lymphoma. So it's already been tested in a number of phase one and two trials, and now further testing is going forward to assess its efficacy.